exciting, scary, and funny. Stunt Barbie. This is a fantastic way to learn about science, and it's eye-opening. The things that you are a tree. Science you can smell and feel gives a new look to the natural world. It's not actually that, like you know, slimy like everyone says. It's it's really nice. For those interested in sports science, there's nothing better than mastering a new skill. Pull this to the corner of your mouth and don't let go. Keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling. I'm going to let go of your hand, you're going to hold it there. Hold it there, hold it there, hold it there. Now let go. And for the older students, this is a valuable chance to talk to employers. I've been told all the different career paths I can take. I've been told about many different universities. I've been told about fields of research I could go into properly. We have the ability to put um, all of those STEM subjects in context uh, for, for young people and until they see those things in context sometimes it's very difficult to relate the subjects that they do at school to what goes on in the in the wider world and what impact that can have on future lives for us it's basically getting the girls out to see the kind of range of industries and the range of careers that um, that, that will be their futures really you know it's, it's the point of the lessons really I think sometimes you have to show kids that they learn stuff for a reason. And spray what? Hey, what colour is the ink? Would that work on really deep down where there's no light? Okay. <laughs> Events like this really open their eyes up to all of those opportunities that are available to them. Um, and it's not just about seeing the opportunities, it's about meeting the people. When do you ever get the opportunity to meet a real scientist or a real engineer? You just don't. The competition winners came up with some simple, groundbreaking experiments. The sunflower seeds, the radish seeds and the turnip seeds that were frozen, they've actually germinated faster than the ones that haven't been frozen by um, one day um, or two days. However, for the dwarf bean seeds, um, the frozen ones, it was quite the opposite. These young scientists will now go through to the finals of the Big Bang UK Young Scientist and Engineer Awards. I have no doubt whatever talking to them that I've been very pleasantly surprised. Each year I've come, I've found that I think more and more have been convinced that the world of science and engineering has something to offer, far more perhaps than they realised before they came. Every year, the Big Bang Fair gets more exciting, more engaging. And most of all, everyone agrees it makes science fun.